going. Hey everybody, Perfect Phoenix here, where, where perfection is nowhere to be found. Last time I left you off at a post-recorded episode where I just explained that I was going to do cleanup. And in this episode, or for me in this sitting, stupid aunt, get off me. I'm going to be doing the Water Wraith and the final dungeon in the game, which we can finally finish between two once and for all. So let's get started. Pressing A for... T Wait, no. Pressing A for sinking in three, two, one, go. This is going to be a pain in the ass, Submerged Castle. If anyone who's been catching on to my channel lately and just see this, like, Submerged Castle right now. For those who don't know, on previous episodes of Pikmin 2, I accidentally deleted my regular file. Where I was supposed to hit the submerged castle. But that was a complete accident. And now I'm kind of facing the submerged castle as um blind as ever. And by blind I mean that I have no really good tools. Yes, yeah, see, it's barely the beginning. Like I just started a new file. Did not jump into any dungeon except the required ones. And basically just start over. Oh yeah, he's he's on fire underwater. I'm gonna be collecting all the treasures because that's what we originally were supposed to do. Anyway, this is the submerged castle. Why is this here? I thought there's something interesting. Submerged Castle, you can only enter this with blue Pikmin. And the entire place is rigged to kill you. I'm not kidding you. And the treasures here aren't really that worth it. This is the Diet Doomer. Oh, and there's our target over there, which... He's kind of in a bad spot, to be perfectly honest with you. Our target here has like the second treasure. Wow, he's in a terrible spot. Shit. I don't really mind losing Pikmin, I just need at least 50. Keep throwing them like this. This is actually a quick way to kill the big guy. If you throw in Pikmin 3, actually, if you throw the Pikmin at their eyes, you can actually stun them for a little bit. It's kind of cool. I mean, you're, you're usually supposed to attack the back area. Anyway, that was a fire bull black, which I know we faced before, but this would be the first time seeing. No, no, the first time seeing one would be in the. Um, no, I don't remember the place. It's been forever since I played Pikmin 2, actually. Bug bait. And there's still more treasure to be found. Can you believe it? Anyway, let's find this treasure. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, there it is. That wasn't hard. <laughs> Go. Get this. Anyway, you may be thinking, for those who don't know, or those who haven't seen a Pikmin 2 Let's Play, Who's the idiot? For those of you who don't know the Submerged Castle, the only reason why it's infamous in Pikmin is, uh, in Pikmin 2 is that we're gonna be encountering something soon enough. You know, once the Pikmin actually get there stuff over there. I'm gonna dismiss everyone and just hang out here. This, I think, is something wheel. I know that for a fact. Pastry wheel. See, I knew. And radar says there's no more treasure. That's good news.
Alright, now here is where things get interesting. Right here you're gonna find a uh, freaking what's it called? Yeah, this thing. And I, I, I never remember what these things are called. Like I said, I haven't played Pikmin 2 in a while. Call everyone. Where's the boatman? There he is. Anyway, this enemy right here. You know what? I already explained all these enemies to you. I'm gonna call them as soon as the thing starts going down. Don't worry about losing your Pikmin to this thing. You see? You don't have to really worry about losing too many blues. At, least, at most, you can probably lose like maybe 20. Because this would be the first dungeon where you would find uh, bulb men. These bulb men are invulnerable to all the elements, and these are super helpful for this dungeon. No, I don't want to carry the ball body, I want to carry the treasure. Stop carrying the body, I want the treasure. But, oh my god. <laughs> Is there anything else here? Oh no, the exit. That's important. There we go. I want all everything to break this open. Thank you. Dismiss. Oh shit, that scared me for a sec. And I say scare me because this is the floor where the infamous monster comes in. No, don't go this way, you stupid idiots. I don't understand why don't they don't go around. Open, you too, come on. Does it say there's a treasure here? Ah, great. God damn it. I'm wasting time. You can cut through the water if you want. They can carry that back. I'm leaving a captain back there because of a emergency escape route. And I'm gonna break this down because once that thing comes in, we're gonna be in big trouble. There's I know there's a treasure down here somewhere. They're usually in set places. Except for some dungeons where they're randomly generated. I think this is the only dungeon where it's not randomly generated. I'm not sure, because I know this was where it was. Actually I wanna pick take these Pikmin with me just in case. As soon as they finish, I mean, goddamn. I'm coming in with no um, purple potions. That's ballsy. Chocolate cushion. God, this is making me hungry. Oh my god. Damn it. Just noticed my Pikmin counter. And you know me, if you see me talking with Wipe Later, everybody, I always make the sex jokes. Anyway, there's no treasure here. I know that. What there is, there, where there is a treasure is up here. Crawling through the pipes, what are we, Mario? Hooey! See, right here. All the boatmen are with us, good. I'm gonna put as much as we can on this. Clear the path. Sorry if I'm quiet, I'm actually recording this 11 at night. You gotta make sure the entire path is clear. I see dweebles. Fiery dweebles to be exact. I wish these guys would hurry up already. That the thing I'm so afraid of it can spawn in at any moment. Stay up there, dweebles. Don't come down or I'll kill you. S 
soil, you son of a bitch. Take it, take it, what are you waiting for? Ah shit, music. Go, 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 please go, please go, please go, please go, please. Hey! Oh, you are dicking with me! Wanna hear the most annoying sound in the world? Oh no. There he is. What is this? I can see my optical sensor sensors. <laughs> I'm, I'm speed reading. I can't help it. I can see my optical receptors, but my sensors can't detect it. Could its physical form be its anchored in another dimension, attacking its feet tile? If only we could force it to take on physical form, but in its current state, danger, danger. And if he, and if that's where it, I think it is. You know what? Let's try this. Go, 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 go! Wow! What are you guys doing? Come! Oh, that was a dick move! It spawned on top of me! Alright, good. That's the last one. Let me jump in. You know, I'm gonna be ballsy and do this. I'm going in with 45 Pikmin. I'm going in with half a hundred. Below half a hundred, even. 45% maybe. I don't know. Actually, yeah, technically 45%. I don't care at this point. <laughs> at least I have a couple Bulbmen, and there will be more Bulbmen. And we got electrical, because if you lost all your bulbmen, then you're technically screwed. These things... I can't afford to lose any more balloons. I have to go loseless on the next two floors. This is actually a five-floor dungeon. Give me a sec, I'll be right back. Oh cool, we got lucky. Blowhog. Oh cool. These things. <laughs> hey, treasure. Oh, we got lucky here. Activity Arouser. <laughs> That's such a dirty name. Alright, you know what? I don't know if we need whites. I don't know if there's anything buried, but if there is, I'm probably gonna kick myself. Oh, cool. Egg. Actually, I'm gonna go in... I'm just going to use the nine bulbmen I have <laughs> and knock out all electrical fences. I'm going to try to avoid all enemy contact. Actually... Louis, you're going to take the blues and you're actually going to work on this. I kind of want to make sure that I definitely don't need whites. Oh wow, the Wally Wally trade go over there. Shit! <sighs> Surprise, motherfucker! No!
good time to run, cowards! Thank you need more men! <laughs> 